Ever wondered if your friend is in love with you? Does she throw around hints, but you're so damn confused because you're supposed to be friends? Well, you're not alone, my friend. This is a common predicament faced by many a gentleman. Most men dismiss these signs because they are in disbelief that a friend or worse, a longtime friend could actually be in love with them. You see, the art of flirtation is a subtle dance, a delicate balance of cues and signals that, unfortunately, doesn't come with a manual. You could be barricading yourself from romance or even better, having a friend with benefits. And let's face it guys, sometimes we're about as good at deciphering these signals as a cat is at quantum physics. But fear not, this is where we step in. Lucky for you, you subscribe to the Ultimate Man channel and are well equipped with these vital pieces of information. You have subscribed, right? Watch till the end because every part of this video is important. Picture this. You're at a party, a beautiful acquaintance or friend across the room is throwing signs your way, and instead of standing there trying to figure out if she's just being friendly or actually flirting, you know exactly what's happening. Sounds good, doesn't it? But worry not, gentlemen, because today we're going to crack the code of flirtation. Buckle up. Do us a favor and hit that like button because it's free for you and it motivates us to keep making these videos, thanks. Sign number one, she can't take her eyes off you. And no, it's not because you have spinach in your teeth. Ever heard of the age-old adage, the eyes are the windows to the soul? Well, in the realm of flirtation, they're more like floodlights, illuminating interest and attraction. When a woman is interested, she'll maintain eye contact longer than usual. It's like she's trying to solve the enigma that is you. So, what's the magic number? Three seconds. Anything less could just be a casual glance, anything more, and you've got her attention. But remember, this isn't a staring contest. It's about subtlety and connection. Let's not forget the power of the look away, look back move. If she glances away, but her eyes keep finding their way back to you, it's a clear signal. So next time you catch her staring, it might not be your funky tie she's interested in. Sign number two, she's touchier than a three-year-old with a new toy. Now gentlemen, this one is a touchy subject, quite literally. You see, when a woman is into you, she'll find ways to initiate physical contact. It's her subtle way of breaking down that invisible barrier between you two. Don't get all flustered though, we're not talking about bear hugs and passionate hand-holding here, no, it's the little things. Maybe she'll playfully nudge you when you crack a joke, or casually brush against your arm when reaching for the popcorn. It could be as simple as a light touch on your shoulder to emphasize a point in conversation. These are all her attempts to establish a connection and gauge your response. But remember, context is key, my friend. If she's swatting you away like an annoying mosquito, that's a different story. Remember, if she's treating you like a human touch screen, it's probably not because she's checking for dust. Sign number three, she laughs at your jokes, even the bad ones. Now we all know you're a funny guy, but let's be honest, not every joke is a home run. When a woman finds everything you say amusing, it's not because you're the next stand-up sensation. Instead, it's a subtle sign of flirtation. Laughter is the universal language of enjoyment. It's a clear indication that she's comfortable around you and enjoys your company. It's her way of saying, hey, you're fun, I like being around you. And let's face it, nobody laughs at a joke they don't find funny unless they have a good reason. So if she's chuckling at your puns, giggling at your one-liners and outright belly laughing at your anecdotes, take note. She's not just being polite, it's likely a sign she's interested in you. So if she's laughing at your dad jokes, she's either really polite or she's into you. Sign number four, she showers you with compliments. And no, nice shirt, is it new? Doesn't count. Now we're talking about the kind of compliments that make you pause, make you blush, make you think, wow, she really sees me. These aren't just offhand remarks about your clothes or your hairstyle, but sincere appreciations about your personality, your intellect, or even your taste in obscure indie rock bands. When a woman is flirting, more specifically, a friend of yours, she'll often find ways to express her admiration in a way that's more personal, more intimate. It could be something as simple as, you have a great sense of humor, or as deep as, I admire how passionate you are about your work. These compliments go beyond the superficial and touch on who you are as a person. But remember gentlemen, context is key. If she's complimenting your taste in music in the middle of a crowded party, she might be flirting with you. Or, she might just really like your playlist. So, if she's complimenting your taste in music, she might be flirting or she just really likes your playlist. Sign number five, she's always in your personal space and not in a creepy way. Now gentlemen, this isn't about her being a stage five clinger, nope. This is about the subtle art of proximity. This is about her always being around, being close, being in your vicinity. Picture this. 
You're at a party and you keep bumping into her. Coincidence? I think not. You see, when a woman is interested, she might just find a reason to be where you are. She's tuned into your frequency and is naturally drawn to your magnetic charm. It's not about her invading your personal bubble. It's about her choosing to share that bubble with you. It's about her wanting to be in that space where the connection can spark and the chemistry can brew. So if she's always at the same parties as you, she might be stalking you. Or more likely, she's flirting. Sign number six she teases you, and not in the playground bully kind of way. You see, women who are interested often use light, playful teasing as a way to break the ice. It's their subtle way of challenging you, of saying, hey, I'm comfortable around you. Now this isn't a license to turn into a middle schooler and start a food fight. No, gentlemen, this is about good-natured, friendly banter. It's the kind of teasing that comes with a smile and a twinkle in the eye. It's her way of saying, I like you and I'm not afraid to show it. So if she's joking about your inability to resist the allure of a good taco, or if she's poking fun at your inexplicable love for 80s power ballads, pay attention. These aren't insults, my friends, these are invitations. So if she's teasing you about your Star Wars obsession, she's probably flirting, or she's just a Trekkie. All right, gentlemen, let's recap, because remembering signs of flirtation is harder than remembering your ex's birthday. First up, we have the flirtation investigation. Remember, if she's playing a little detective, asking about your relationship status or your favorite kind of pizza, she's not trying to join the FBI, she's likely flirting. Next, we have the eye contact equation. If her peepers are locked onto yours more often than her phone screen, take it as a sign. It's not a staring contest, it's probably flirtation. And no, she's not checking if you have something in your teeth. Then comes the touchy subject. If she's finding reasons to touch you, like swatting a non-existent bug off your shoulder, she's not a germaphobe, she's probably flirting. Bugs are everywhere, but flirtatious touches aren't. The laughing matter is next. If she's laughing at your jokes, even the ones that would make a comedian cringe, she's not auditioning for a sitcom, she's likely flirting. And yes, even if your jokes are as dry as a desert. Number 5. The Compliment Conundrum If she's complimenting you, even if it's about how neatly you tied your shoelaces, she's not a fashion critic, she's probably flirting. Shoelaces can be fascinating, but compliments are even more so. Then we have the proximity principle. If she's always in your vicinity, even if the room is as big as a football field, she's not lost, she's likely flirting. GPS can fail, but flirtation rarely does. Finally, the teasing test. If she's teasing you, even about your love for pineapple on pizza, she's not a food snob, she's probably flirting. Pineapple on pizza can be controversial, but teasing is a surefire sign. So, there you have it. The next time you're wondering if she's flirting, remember these signs, and may the flirtation force be with you. Well, there you go gentlemen, hope you found value in this video. Again, don't forget to like, subscribe, share, and save this video. If you have a strategy that you think that we should know about, go ahead and leave it in the comments so our community can learn, grow, and take advantage of the information. See you in our next video.